All right, folks, today we had the easiest and most successful giveaway I've ever had on these Elector D10s. And uh, I posted them up at work, and by the time I got home, Randy Blankenship had already followed all the instructions, watched the whole video, apparently, saw the code he needed to enter, emailed it to me at the address that was in the description below. Always read that, folks. See, you miss out, and you miss out when you don't watch the whole thing. So let's get to the intro, and I'll come back, and I'm going to leave a few details, mostly for Randy, but for you if you ever get a set of these without uh, an owner's manual. All right, I'm back, and thanks once again to Randy for following all the instructions of the seven people who viewed the video. I mean, two were me, so that's only five. Uh, the average watch time was four minutes and 23 seconds. Wow, you didn't even get to the end where you could have seen the code. Apparently, Randy did. He saw it. I uploaded this from work. He saw it. And by the time I got home, bam, it was already done. He'd already emailed me everything. So, now if you look here, oh, dear God, Randy, I forgot the earbuds. No, I didn't. They're in here. Try reaching around here and not break anything. And this uses a nice mechanical latch. Click. Done. All right, so I'm going to pull them out. Now, I, I realized I don't have to search for how to parent to each other because if you watch, you'll see. Bleep, bleep, bleep. Done. They're paired to each other. Now all you got to do is find them on your phone. And let's go over the controls first. Two clicks here. On the right side, volume or track goes to the next track. Two clicks on this one, previous track, if you had one when you started playing them. Uh, three clicks here, volume goes up. Three clicks here, and your best bet is to put your finger behind your ear, and that way, when these are screwed up into your ear, like so, you know, you'll get a good press on the button. And that way, be like having your finger behind it, unless the tips are big enough to keep them from pushing into your ear. Depends how good you are with stuff in your ear. So, that's all we got there. Now let's show you on your phone. Hmm. Sorry. Oops, I just bumped the camera mount. We're going to go into our settings and connect it and turn our brightness. Oh, yeah. hmm. And you'll go into your Bluetooth settings here, and there you'll see them. Now, I'm already connected because I already paired them up once. Elector D10. Dash L. You may occasionally, if you pair to something else in the meantime, have to go back and check that. You know, reconnect them. Uh, it's always the left ear, but these are not usable separately. Always pair to the left, and you'll get both of them, in, and it'll say, second device connected, which is your other ear. That would be elector dash d10 dash r. And that's all there is to it. Uh, the instructions will be in the description below. Make sure you read that. As usual, we're filming this on the Mi A2. 
Oh, someday we'll be filming stuff like this in the Mi A3 shortly. Uncle Sam says they are processing my texture turnout currently. And then you'll just drop them in here when you're done with them. And they'll turn off. Then you'll get your... Well, you might. This one didn't. Gotta drop them in and make contact. And you'll get your little red lights like that one. And the other one's a little dimmer. Don't know why. Uh, well, I know why. But these are still $29.95 over at, uh, or $29.99 on Prime. Uh, now we're going to close it and put it back. Well, we're not going to put it back. Let's look at the other pieces, parts in here. And what we've got, when you pull out the box, you'll hear anything you hear when you get it is going to be a USB to micro USB cable and you should get 10 more sets of earbuds in there. Uh, the 12 sets already on them. You get the conical types and then you get the uh, uh, kind of squared off ones. Some people preferred those. Uh, they're a little stiffer, harder to put on and off and as far as plugging USB cable in. You'll plug this into, oh, roughly a two amp charger. Will not hurt them. You plug it right in here. These two little lights will sit there and blink, 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 blink until she's full. Probably take you an hour, hour and a half if it's dead, but it should be. I mean, I charged this earlier today. I've had them on for a few seconds, as you can see. I played around trying to get to the assistant and couldn't get there. So, if I find that, it will be in the description below. In the meantime, that's all I have. Thanks for watching, and folks, check us in the next one. And if you subscribe and click the little bell, you could have been the first ones on the scene to get these if you're from North America like Randy is. He followed all the instructions to the letter. And that's all I have for tonight. We'll catch you in the next video. Thanks for watching. We're out of here. By the way, those are the Elector D12s back there.